Santa Barbara traffic. I'm walking up again. And I guess the seal is down here on the beach and he is actually enjoying uh, watching all this traffic go by. I don't think any of this traffic has even noticed the little seal. Santa Barbara. We didn't even got a Gap, well, just above that frame. Or, this may be a sea lion. I doubt he'll let me get any closer to him. But we can try. See how far he'll let me get. You guys will have to help me determine whether it's a sea lion or a seal. You tell me, what is it? Yeah, I'm here. I'm with it. I'm out here on the beach. We got seagulls. The seagulls ain't even taking off and running from me. And this guy could get aggressive, but I don't know. He may be hurt. You see footprints, bear footprints. Hope he ain't hurt. He is hurt. Slippers. Hi, baby. I ain't gonna bother you. Looks like an older one. His uh, face has got the uh, a little bit older look. Look at all the seagulls. There's my truck, big truck. There's the mountain. He's definitely got a damaged flipper on his backbone. Uh, he's obviously been at, at shark attack at one time. And uh, this is his little home. I imagine this little cove. So probably the locals knows he's even here. Uh, they probably come down and see him occasionally. This, this is where he lives. He looks like he's an older. Uh, I'm going to suspect seal. Uh, the backbone flippers. I, no, I'm gonna suspect this is a small sea lion, but you know I'm, I don't know a whole lot about them. Just to let me get a little closer. I ain't gonna bother you, boy. I ain't trying to catch you. I see that you're hurt. He's definitely dragging his back flippers. He's not, uh, you know, walking with them, and they can definitely walk with the flippers and stuff. He's been uh, he's back on it. could be a propeller accident that possibly. So there you go. He's looking, he's watching. He's kind of getting a look at his back here, his spinal cord and his back feet. He doesn't want to get back out in the cold water. Yeah, I can see the damage on his uh, jaw as well. Okay, boy, I'm going to leave you alone. I don't want you to have to get back in that old cold water. He's been in a boating accident, what I would suspect. But then, of course, the scars could be the shark. You know, the shark could have done that as well for him. They can actually drink the salt water, obviously. He just took a drink. So, I guess, naturally, uh, they can die against salt water, which our bodies cannot do.
I don't want to bother him and uh, make him uncomfortable. This is possibly what he's been eating out here. There's a lot of shells. Yeah, he went on into the water, obviously. Oh, there he goes. He's swimming. I'm sure that his back leg does not hurt him, uh, you know, as far as getting around on the beach here and staying close, but uh, deep sea swimming and stuff, I'm sure he can't do a lot of that. So he probably feeds around uh, these this area humans. Uh, here's a crab. The bird just ate it. It's still alive. The thing is still, its feet are still moving, but the tentacles and everything else has been eaten off of it. <laughs> and it, it was digging a hole. The bird's much as claws and everything off and left the body. That's the best uh, part was the body. I would have thought. Part of the sea dollar. Part of the sea dollar. Actually, not a very long ago, a live one at that, it looks like. I wonder if they uh, just like uh, minnows, small fish that uh, worship in the in the waves. I wonder if they uh, can catch those. Then we got these long billed birds. They just scooping up what little trash they can. Got the little island here in our background. Look at that long billed sucker. He's just out there scooping up whatever he can. He's got a unique uh, color of feathers. Did my still come back? No, he he's still out playing. He's going to go out and do a little exercise. I really didn't want him to have to get back out in the water, but he did. decided that he's going to go back out in the water. From Cuba. Cuba, yeah. But actually, I got this one in Miami. He come over to get out of Cuba. He didn't like Fidel.